Welcome to the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Wyborny, and this is 4 times 6 is more than simply 24. Every now and then you might hear someone ask, what is 4 times 6? And you may hear someone else answer, 4 times 6 is 24. What is interesting is that this question can mean several different things. When someone asks, what is 4 times 6? What they might mean is, 4 times 6 is equal to what number? The answer to that question is 24. 4 times 6 is equal to 24. And that is an important idea. But they may also know that there are many other important ideas. So when someone asks, what is 4 times 6? They may be wondering, what does 4 times 6 mean? And that is an important question. In this video, let's take a closer look at both of these ideas. 4 times 6 is equal to 24. Let's examine some ways that 4, 6, and 24 are related to each other. To begin, if 4 times 6 is equal to 24, then 6 times 4 is also equal to 24. And since multiplication is related to division, we also know that 24 divided by 4 is equal to 6, and 24 divided by 6 is equal to 4. If we look at 24 divided by 6 is equal to 4, we can see that there are several different ways to write this idea. We can write 24 divided by 6 is equal to 4. Or we can write 24 divided by 6 is equal to 4. And that can be very useful. So understanding 4 times 6 is more than simply knowing that the product is 24. Here is an array. We know that an array that is 6 by 4 will have a total of 24. And we also know that we can break 24 apart into six groups of four, just like this. And when we put six groups of four together, the total is 24. And we know that we can break 24 apart into four groups of six, just like this. And when we put four groups of six together, the total is 24. So we can think of four times six as four groups of six. You may recognize this as repeated addition, and if we count the groups of 6, we can see that there are 1, 2, 3, 4 groups of 6, and the total of 4 groups of 6 is 24. And if 4 times 6 is equal to 24, we also know that 6 times 4 is equal to 24. So we can think of 24 as 6 groups of 4. If we count the groups of 4, we can see that there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 groups of 4, which is equal to 24. 4 times 6 is equal to 24, and there are many more important ideas. When we look on the multiplication table, we can see that 4 times 6 is equal to 24. 24 is a multiple of 4, and 24 is also a multiple of 6. In fact, if you look closely, you'll find another connection. You'll see that 24 is the sixth multiple of 4. I'll count the multiples of 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And 24 is the fourth multiple of 6. I'll count the multiples of 6. 1, 2, 3, 4. Understanding that 24 is a multiple of both 4 and 6 is very important. 4 times 6 is equal to 24 and there are many important ideas related to the number 24. As we think about the number 24, we know that if we divided it into six equal parts, like this, that each part would be 1 6th of 24, and 1 6th of 24 is equal to 4. And at the same time, if we divide 24 into four equal parts, each part would be 1 4th of 24 and 1 4th of 24 is equal to 6. When you examine 4 times 6 is equal to 24, you may notice that 24 is greater than 4, and 24 is also greater than 6. But how many times greater? Here is the answer. 24 is 6 times greater than 4. And there's another connection. 24 is also 4 times greater than 6. As you can see, there are many relationships among these numbers. So 4 times 6 is equal to 24, and that is an important idea. But as you can tell, it's not the end of the story. There are many more relationships, many more connections, and many more ideas waiting to be discovered as we take a closer look at multiplication. 
This is the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Whitehorny, and this is a reminder that 4 times 6 is more than simply 24.